I got certified in cybersecurity in 24 hours, and then things took a left turn. Join me in this video. I'm gonna tell you how to get certified for free and avoid the mistakes that I did in the process. I'm Boyd Clues, internationally recognized cybersecurity expert, and I help IT pros upgrade their jobs to six-figure tech careers. If you wanna join me on this journey, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and make sure you thump that bell so that you're notified whenever I drop new content guaranteed to take your career to six figures and beyond. So I'm working at the NOC, which is the network operating center, working overnight, and my company asked me to take over the role of managing our vulnerability scanner. So I became the vulnerability scanner operator. Overnight, I would run scans for all of our systems around the US looking for vulnerabilities on firewalls, systems such as servers, desktops, all that good stuff. And it was cool. It was cool. I really enjoyed it. And I started doing my research. When I did my research, I found out that system security specialists or professionals working in vulnerability management could earn six figures and beyond. And that was really what I needed. Cause at that point I was only making $60,000 and I had three kids and a wife and whew, times were tough. Do you hear me? Times were tough. Let me know in the comments if you can relate to that. Trust me, times were tough. So what I did was I went and asked my manager if I could take a little time to get some training done so I could add more value and improve my skill set. If you're paying attention, that is a nugget for you, how you can get your companies to actually sponsor training and give you time off, right? So I went and dedicated a full day to learning this system. The vulnerability scanner that we use was actually called Qualys. And yes, I do have a video about this training that has over a million views. The training was Qualys and it was phenomenal, phenomenal completely free. I did this training online. I became a vulnerability management specialist certified. The heavens opened y'all. I was excited. My first cybersecurity certification. I got the certification. I up updated my LinkedIn profile. I updated my resume, my dice profile, and I started sending it out everywhere because I knew I needed to make more money. And the coolest thing happened, y'all, the coolest thing. I got a phone call, right, from a recruiter that said, hey, we got your resume and we're actually looking for someone to interview for a vulnerability management specialist position. I was like, yes, what's the name of the company? And they said American Airlines. And at this time, guys, I'm like 23 years old, about to interview for a vulnerability management position at the world's largest airline. I was terrified. I was terrified. I was also confident. Why? Because I was certified. I had been running the, the vulnerability management scanner. I had the certification and I was hungry. I was hungry. So what I did was I went to this interview and I showed up like the man. Looking good, smelling good, feeling good. You know how it goes, right? And I interview with the manager. So we talk about scanning strategies, adding value, remediation plans. And I'm like, man, I am crushing this interview. This is all you got. But then there was a few questions that I stumbled over, but I thought it was nothing. I thought it was nothing, absolutely nothing. So we end the interview, I leave, I get the phone call from the recruiter and I'm like, yes. Tell me the good news. He was like, hey man, I just talked to Gary. He said that you did well in the interview, but they are going to go with another candidate. I was like, wait, what? Wait, what? Another candidate? The certification? I got this Koala shirt. Y'all, I even had the CISSP at the time. I'm like, why are they not going with me? And so he said, man, let me just be transparent with you. You didn't have the skills that they were looking for for that particular position. And y'all, my mind was blown. Maybe you've experienced that. Let me know in the comments if you have a college degree, you got some certifications and it just seems like no matter how many job interviews you go to, you just keep coming up short. I know I can't be the only one. Let me know down in the comments. The biggest mistake that I made in this whole process was I didn't take the time to understand the company that I was interviewing at, nor did I take the time to understand the why behind running the vulnerability scanner. 
What happens is too many people get stuck in the day to day of running tasks, running the scanner, but they don't understand the big picture. And when you get to a level of compensation above 100K, companies are looking for people that understand the business objective and not just how to do things. Because I can design a complex process and break it down individually for people to do it step by step. And I can pay the people very little money that are doing step by step but the guy that's designing the process is going to get the big bag. I hope that y'all understand and, and y'all recognize what I'm saying. It is critical. Hopefully you realize through my story that being certified doesn't equal job. It just doesn't. There's skill and there's other things that come along with the certification that will put you in position to land a job. I experienced that a lot over my life. As a matter of fact, I'm pretty sure many of you have. And if that is your testimony, then I invite you to do something different. If you look in the description, you'll see a link for the Baxter Clues Trading Academy. You can go to boydclues.com forward slash GRC and apply to join the Baxter Clues Trading Academy where I have helped hundreds of IT guys upgrade their skills to be able to walk into high paying jobs without needing any certifications or college degrees. If you were willing to put in the work, adapt the authority mindset, then why couldn't you? If you got value from this video, be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and check out some of these resources right here too, guaranteed to help you take your career to the next level. Well, that's it for this one. I'll see you all next guys. Peace.